Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you how to remove a keyboard keycap without any special tools. This will be a full tutorial and also a super easy tutorial, so let's get right into the video. As you can see, this is a keyboard and each of these is an individual keycap and you can actually remove them if you want to clean the keyboard or clean the keycaps or replace them or anything like that, you're gonna have to remove them first. Okay, you don't have to remove them, but it definitely makes it much easier if they are removed. So let's get right into the video. As you can see, all that you need to do is you need to gain access to the little tiny little area underneath the keycap because these basically just pop out of place. So if you can find a way to gain access to the individual keycap and you can find something that can slide under there, you can pop it out of place. So you can use a little guitar pick, that's an option that is thin enough to slide under there, or a ruler and you can see this is still a fairly thick ruler. If you have a thinner one it's even better or anything that's thin and strong, but what you can do is push one key down and when I push the space bar down it gives me a little bit more access to this area right here so I can get the ruler I can sort of angle it to get it underneath there like this as you can see I can also push this down over here I can angle it to get it underneath there and I can just pop it out of place I'm gonna actually try and just get a better angle by going on this side right here as you can see I can lodge it under there and it could just pop it out just like that so as you can see I've now popped out the keycap now I can clean in there, which you can see is quite dirty. I can clean in there. I can replace the keycap if you need to replace an individual one. And it's literally that easy. And the beautiful thing about it is that once you've removed one keycap like this, it becomes much easier to remove the other ones because now I now have access to these keycaps over here. So I can go ahead and pop these ones out if I really wanted to. There goes that one. I'm going to have to go get that right over here. Give me a second. So like I said, um, you know, you now have access to these ones over here. So once you've popped one out of place, it becomes much easier to do the rest. But that's it. That is how to remove a keyboard keycap without any special tools. There are keycap pullers that you can you can get. Um, but like I said, you really don't need them in my opinion. For the most part, you can just use anything that's thin enough and strong enough to get under it. And you can use the ability to push a different key down to get a little bit more leverage under there. That's it. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching